na mention ninyo sa statement is merong dissatisfaction among the MILF officials, members, and, and your supporters, no? And uh, na mention nyo, uh, they were not accommodated despite their competence. I see this as parang uh, kasi you mentioned nepotism, eh, no? Uh, in a way, ang, ang dating sa akin is you're accusing this present leadership in the BARM of nepotism. Of, and then, may, may nabanggit nyo rin po na you can count with, you, with your fingers kung uh, ilan ng mga organic uh, members ng MILF dyan sa press sa BTA. Uh, well, uh, can you elaborate on this? Well, uh, may, meron pong kasi mga lumalabas na mga listahan ganyan na okay. nag-mention specifically yung mga pangalan. I don't want to be repetitive pero lumabas okay. na ito. Okay. Na relative nung uh, nakakataas, mga ganon. Uh, tapos uh, kung meron daw diyan portal na sinasabi, kung mag-apply ka, uh, i-channel doon sa portal uh, hmm. para maghintay ka na lang uh, kung uh, uh, positive or negative, we will be receiving uh, uh, reply, response, mga ganon. Pero wala pong nangyayari doon na uh, Uh, pag uh, uh, qualified ka naman uh, pero all of a sudden na uh, uh, nasabihan ka na na build up na yung uh, position na ninanasa mo uh, tinatarget mo nang uh, less than qualified or not even qualified uh, at it turn out na uh, may uh, relative may may merong kaugnayan doon sa menu relationship doon sa uh, appointing authority mga ganung bagay ba Uh, so, uh, in short, uh, ginawa natin ito, dito, pinalawas natin dito, sabagat kung uh, uh, meron po tayong room mm-hmm. or check, checking it is out uh, para maituin natin, eh, sa atin, ituin yan, sabagat uh, hindi po tama. Mm-hmm. Marami pong nagugulat at uh, uh, kasi I, I mentioned earlier no, at that there was a time na ikaw ang face ng MILF. Ikaw ang humaharap sa media. Ikaw ang kinakausap ng mga reporters. Anong nangyari at uh, uh, hindi ka kasama sa mga uh, leaders na, na di ba? Uh, yes, yes. Nakaupo sa mga dyan sa BTA. Yes. Matagal na istorya ito. Actually, uh, nag-umpisa ito for the sake of our uh, listening public. Uh, at para may tuwid natin yung tamang uh, istorya. I sometimes in uh, 20 basta no vice mayor si then mayor uh, president Duterte we we talked to him uh, uh, with uh, governor Pinyul uh, para lang ma enhance natin yung uh, effort uh, uh, dito sa sa, sa peace process na ito uh, on my own uh, initiative ngayon na uh, gusto nila akong isuspend uh, sapagkat uh, ang sabi nila uh, not a violation sapagkat uh, uh, wala akong authority to talk to these people and then ang policy kasi we do not recognize sa uh, Philippine Constitution eh, pag kinausap po yung mga tao na wala sa lugar eh, that can't amount to uh, recognizing the Philippine Constitution and so uh, nung mapansin ko na gano'n na po yung pangyari kako Uh, I'm tendering my courtesy resignation. Uh, irrevocable. Sapagkat ako na wala na ako ng moral ascendancy to uh, carry on my task uh, assigned to me by the organization. So I am now tendering my irrevocable resignation. That was on June 20, 2010. To be exact. And then, uh, nagkaroon ng meeting ang Central Committee two days after. And so, do, pinalabas pa rin nila na I was uh, kicked out from the organization. Okay. But the truth is not. You resigned. Okay. Uh, Mr. Cabalo, anong assessment mo sa leadership ni uh, Chief Minister uh, Murad Ibrahim? Uh, kasi it's very clear na may dissatisfaction among uh, uh, suspended or expelled or you still consider yourself uh, members of the MILF, no? Uh, may credibility pa ba 
sa tingin mo na magpatuloy si uh, Prime Minister Murad? Well, uh, it's very difficult to judge uh, huh? uh, sa mga punto na yan. Uh, sabihin nila, bias tayo. Huh? Uh, because uh, we are coming out with this kind of uh, statement. But the truth of the matter is, uh, uh, mer- meron pa rin siyang credibility. Uh, alangan naman, uh, he, he had been a leader of this front uh, for a quite long time. We appreciated that so much. But look at the reality. Uh, kung pag-usapan ng credibility, and then uh, yung sinasabi nilang, intact pa. And then people that continue, uh, uh, meron silang crowd, uh, people that continue listening to them, uh, yung pong naging resulta ng recently conducted election ay uh, magsasabi po ng uh, katotohanan na iyan na po yung uh, status as far as uh, the credibility of our leader is concerned. Wala okay. pong nanaro uh, sa mga kongresista na kanilang sinuportahan throughout the Balm area. Okay. Wala pong nanalo okay. na governor throughout the Balm na kanina pong sinuportahan. Okay. No provide okay. governor. Okay. Uh, dito okay. sa Maguindanao, uh, wash out yung uh, board members in the second district, dalawa lang sa first district, and then uh, nine out of 36 mayors, anim lang, o siyam lang ang kanilang uh, uh, nakuha. Uh, so, yan po yung mga mga batayan. Na yung presidente po, uh, talo po si si Madam Lenny dito sa Maguindanao. Malayo-malayo po ang uh, agwa. Uh, so, yung sinasabi mo, yung outcome ng elections, ng May elections would speak a lot about the uh, kung anong level ng credibility that uh, Murad has. Still has. Yes, yes. I agree. I agree. Uh, sapagkat uh, wala naman tayong uh, measure na makikita so far ngayon. Uh, mm-hmm. Kung pwede lang, eh, tanungin natin individually lahat ng mga tao, one by one, but uh, hindi natin kakayanin yan. But uh, okay. ito kasi, hindi lang ito suporta na, uh, ika nga, moka lang, mora lang, kung what, it, it, it even imposed upon the, the members of the MRF and the community to support their in those uh, uh, candidates uh, locally and nationally. But uh, mm-hmm. ano nangyari? Uh, you know, ito nga. The result speak for itself. Mahirap na pong magsalita sapagkat uh, lalo lamang tayong uh, uh, malagay sa ikanga ang uh, uh, giit ng uh, galit nila sa atin. Mm-hmm. Uh, I, I, I take note, no? I have taken note that uh, in, in one of your statements, uh, you called the mainstream members of the the mainstream M- uh, MILF members as pseudo revolutionaries uh uh medyo harsh uh, medyo tough words no to to ano uh, are you saying na uh, this group has has uh, gone astray far from the ideals that uh, ha- uh, Salamat Hashim has fought for or well, had fought for. Well, uh, the fact that never mentioned na po yung ideology ni uh, then uh, late chairman Salamat Hashim never in their uh, affairs na nanababanggit na ito. Ipa, ito yung pinag-aawayan eh. Bakit gagamitin daw namin uh, yung Salamat name Salamat? Sabagat we stick to the ideology of uh, uh, salamat sa Hashim. Andi diyan na po sa statement na pinalabas natin. So, uh, hindi naman sinasabi natin na uh, go astray but uh, uh, obviously nagdibiyet sila doon sa linya na yun. Uh, okay. But uh, then again, uh, nagkaroon ng mga development uh, uh, through the negotiations. Uh, uh, okay naman po yun. So, pagkat, uh, as far as uh, salamat ng discussion, we respect it, we acknowledge it and we even supported the full implementation of uh, this agreement, signed agreement between the government and the MRF. May isang point uh, na na-raise din. Sabi ninyo, y- you're asking uh, Presidential Legal Council one point in really to make an opinion or to rule on uh, the legality of uh, Mr. Ibrahim serving as uh, uh, interim interim chairman of the BARM and at the same time 
as commander in chief of the Bangsamoro Islamic uh, Armed Forces of the MILF. May nakikita ho ba kayong legal issue dito? Bakit po? Ganito po ata yan. Sapagkat uh, if you recall, uh, they already uh, sure in to defend the constitution uh, of of, uh, uh, of the Philippines. Uh, mm-hmm. Ngayon, uh, ang uh, ang sabi nila, tapos na po ang uh, struggle ng MLF. Ito na po yung naging resulta. Okay. Mm-hmm. But uh, yung pong mga directive nila na gin- still using the title uh, chairman MRF and that of uh, the commander of uh, Uh, the Bangsamoro Islamic Armed Forces. Uh, uh, para bang hindi tumutugma uh, doon sa naging uh, uh, resulta ng uh, uh, negotiation and finally uh, sumumpa sila na independ yung uh, uh, constitution. So, yung gusto siguro ng mga kasama natin, yung li- mga legal minds, na tingnan yung legality uh, nitong uh, uh, issue nito. Meron bang uh, violation yan o wala? So it's better na... Uh, Ang gusto niyo ho ba is uh, mamili si uh, Chief Minister Ibrahim kung barmin, uh, siya ang Chief Minister or uh, magpapatuloy siya as uh, Commander-in-Chief of the Armed Forces of the MILF? Well, well, wala tayo sa, sa, sa position to, to uh, uh, si uh, ano yung gusto natin na uh, uh, Una, dito sa pag-chief uh, minister, eh, nasa discretion po ng Pangulo yan. In this country, only the president has the authority to appoint uh, from the position of director pataas, presidente lang yan. Uh, nobody can question, hindi naman Supreme Court. Now the Congress has the authority to appoint uh, uh, officially ng gobyerno. Uh, doon sa pagka uh, uh, chairman yan, sa pag-MLF, uh, ang, uh, ang, ang uh, tingin ng nakakarami. ay hindi na po natin pwede gamitin yan. So that we already, uh, ika nga, nag, nanong pa na po tayo uh, doon sa mga kanyang na uh, iwanan na natin itong kuwan, uh, itong uh, uh, pagkaribeli. Uh, in fact, ito yung isa sa mga uh, punto na gusto nating uh, ituwid. Uh, sana po ang, uh, ang uh, uh, BAM should push through with the enactment of uh, uh, law Uh, yung pong amnesty law para po sa mga member ng MLR. So, so that once and for all, malinis na po yung ating uh, pagkatao as far as uh, legal uh, status is concerned. 